How's it going guys? Glad you are here and as you guys can see up here I finally put in on my top fall selection. Um, the weather is changing fast and it's getting cold so it's finally time to bring on the heavy heaters. This is my time of the year. Uh, as you, you guys know the drill already this is top 10 fragrances but 5 for day, 5 for 9 time of juices available to me in my collection. Uh, reminding that I'm all about the art of perfumery so I'm more into complicated fragrances I'm all about niche but um, another thing taking consideration that I live in Vancouver Canada and it rains a lot and it gets cold fast I have to say that this was the most complicated list I've ever done because I've been wearing a lot of things and I have a lot of juices available and I try to come up with something that um, I'm enjoying quite a lot and is a mixture in between niche and designers. If you guys want in the next time or the next top selection I make, one designer, one niche, let me know, comment down below and I will separate it, I will make two different because uh, there are definitely a lot of juices out there. Um, I won't be showing you the actual bottles as I said before because um, it's gonna be like too messy a lot of bottles around here I don't want to take them out of my storage so but be sure I have all these bottles available to me and I've been wearing them a lot so here we go Guys, starting with daytime, right? Um, in fifth place, I have something that my man Leo from Brazil mentioned on our collab video. This is just an amazing woody scent, uh, rich vetiver based fragrance, uh, some violets, and overall mossy and humid fragrance. Uh, does great at this time of the year. I get tons of compliments, even though it's not sweet. It's not my kind of jar of fragrance, but the results are amazing for this time of the year. In fifth place, I have Rocky Mountain Wood from D Squared. Just an amazing woods scent, guys. You guys have to check that out. Fourth place, while I have something old school, at least to me, I, when I, I started wearing it when I was a teenager, so it brings me a lot of memories. Uh, this is a, an amazing citrus tobacco fragrance. As I said, brings me a lot of memories. Uh, it's a really bright fragrance, really energetic, and um, it lasts a good amount of time on my skin. Um, in number four, I have a Hera for Man from Carolina Hera. Just a really nice scent, guys. You, as I said before, you have to take it out. In third place, I have a fragrance that was my first contact with the Oud Note. Uh, badass fragrance, boozy, woodsy, syrupy and uh, some mandarins to make it sweet really really nice fragrance it lasts at least six hours on my skin projects amazingly for the first two to three hours really nice for fall i cannot ask for more number three i have dairy english from juicy couture beautiful bottle presentation guys this is just an amazing amazing fragrance for the price point is just you have to check it out Number two, I just reviewed this fragrance, the best tea base fragrance from the designer world. Amazing, serious, and sexy at the same time. Black tea with cinnamon and cloves. Love it at this time of the year. And I've been getting a lot of wearings on that one. Number two, I have Gucci put on Du by Gucci. Number one, fall guys, daytime. I have something that is amazing. Uh, it brings me again a lot of memories and is definitely is definitely complimented by this time of the year. Vancouver, as you might know, it rains a lot during fall. We might get like eight months out of the whole year of rain. And this is perfect for rainy days. Um, this is the based on the classic oak moss based fragrances with citrus without being sweet top. I reviewed it and I will put the link for the review in the comment uh, in the description box. In number one spot daytime for fall I have Grey Jones by Bond number 9. 
great great fragrance from bond number no. nine uh very mature very elegant uh i don't see a lot of people talking about this one but i enjoy it quite a lot guys that was my top list for daytime now let's go for the nighttime reminding you guys i don't go clubbing that much but when i do i like to be loud with my friends and uh, so i have something that it could be worn clubbing dating and going out with friends or whatever let's go for my top five list nighttime number five well i have something cheapy but i love it because it's sweet it's a woody oriental uh it starts with load and nice and licorice and dries down to a point where vanilla very sexy very sweet and it's amazing for this time of the year guys it lasts at least six hours on my six hours on my skin and i've got up to 10 hours with this fragrance and for the price point i couldn't ask for anything more than that well number fifth spot we're gonna have blue sugar by aqualina guys presentation is a cheapy fragrance but let me tell you the scent is amazing i love it at least fourth place well this is great for cold nights really cold um it, this is very 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 powdery simple no breakdown but yet the smell is very complex uh it's definitely not a crowd pleaser pleaser um but i do love it the base we're gonna have amber and vanilla more vanilla than amber but it's an amazing fragrance for sure and i adore it every time i wear it um fourth place we're gonna have blue amber by montal amazing fragrance guys you know the presentation team can you know everything about montel's bottles uh, just let me tell you just something blue amber might make my top three from the montel house you guys will see that well number three spot famous on youtube everyone knows about this one boozy top caramel dry down he does great clubbing any time of the year but especially at this time the cold weather compliment getter left and right chicks loves it um I, I even got complimented by guys so that that could tell you something you guys know already from the tia himuglia house we have pure mode limit 2009 limited edition comes and goes from time to time but this is an amazing fragrance guys um number two now we are getting to the two more special from my list number two nighttime very very one more very addicting um was quite off putting at first but once you get into it guys this is an amazing i cannot live without anymore uh it's pretty much everything that you can ask for going clubbing we have the makeup iris it dries down to a powdery nice cook cocoa with the vanilla penny dropper magic in a bottle call it whichever way you want my number two for my top fall is Diorama Intense the original formulation guys I haven't smelled the, the, the new formulation kinda scared of doing it because I praise this fragrance a lot guys number one if you guys have seen the collab video you guys know already what it is Cubby, thank you my boy once again for doing the collab video. Guys, this one is fall in a bottle to me. Amazing, amazing, nutty, uh, toasted nuts, hazelnuts, smell mild sweet. Um, this is a limited edition, 2011. So if you want to go grab a bottle right now because it's going to be out of the market soon. Woody dry down, just an amazing... Uh, guys in my number one spot for fall nighttime is praline de santal from parfumerie general guys to tell as i said it's a limited edition it's just an amazing it doesn't last that long on my skin though that's the only problem i have with it i get around six hours with it but it's just an amazing smell the whole toasted hazelnut uh, it just reminds me of fall. It's just amazing fragrance, guys. I really, really advise you to go there and try that out because uh, you won't regret it. It's just beautiful. Um, guys, well, this is it. My top five daytime, my top five nighttime for fall finally has come out. 
better late than never, right? Um, let me know what you guys think about it. Um, let me know your top uh, heaters for this fall. I, I've been watching everybody else's videos and I'm loving it. I love seeing top selection. I think I believe who doesn't, right? Um, that's it. It's your boy V. Yeah.